So we're up bright and early, and I have to say there is nothing, absolutely nothing better than waking up and being able to play a brand new, exciting video game. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to part two of Resident Evil 4 Remake. Bruce Secondor 1, I've got that intel you requested on Louis Sarah. It seems he used to be a researcher for Umbrella. Umbrella? I should have left him in that bag to rot. <laughs> I'm sending you the details. Take a look, but Baby Eagle is your priority. Copy that. Making my way to the church. Condor 1, out. Alright, so we're going back to the church. And I'm kind of glad we're starting off here. Uh, view file. Hold on, I think we've got a file. Hold on. Could it be about Luis? Yes. So it says Sarah's name uh, first appears publicly in a, in a university student registry. No prior records have been discovered, including his birth certificate. After graduating from university, he was employed by Umbrella's research division, where he became a rising star who won favor amongst his peers. Uh, he was involved in the development of several common over-the-counter drugs, all of which were discounted or discontinued before ever reaching the market. See the attached list for details. A few years later, Sarah resigned from the Umbrella and could not be located. After the Raccoon City incident, efforts were made by law enforcement and the government to track down anyone with the links to Umbrella, but despite conducting an extensive research, they were unable to find him. Considering how well he uh, evaded them, we are almost certain that Sarah went to a great lengths to disappear. In Hunnigan's handwriting, comment over the counter, drugs. Do you seriously think that Umbrella would let one of their best work on some antacid or beauty cream and antacid antacid so it's kind of crazy how, how all these like notes and, and and little details within the universe of resident evil um it's just interesting how much detail there is and how many characters were part of the raccoon city incident so much so that they can literally just make extra games about what happened with these characters during dur during that time you know, and I feel like also Resident Evil 5, since we uh, recently played it, it also showcased a lot of that as well. Super, super interesting. Anyways, um, I wanted to come here and, and actually go over there. I was really excited to, to start the episode here because I thought I was going to be able to get the chest or the loot upstairs. But it seems like we're going to need a buddy, whether it's Ashley or Lewis or whoever it may be. I want to say... Oh, that's the wolf. He's back. You too, huh? Oh my god, he's back. Take care of yourself, buddy. Guys, please save the wolf. Not only is it good for for your heart, but uh, it's gonna be good for you down the down the road eventually. Anyways, now we've got this key, which is gonna allow us to um, access some very uh, necessary areas within this game. Please tell me you've got a flashlight. It's kind of dark here. So I've been thinking, I think what I'm going to be doing for this series, I mean, obviously it just depends how the views are and stuff like that, but um, I'm probably going to be doing like a video, a chapter. There's, I think, a total of 16 chapters. The first episode was two chapters, so that leaves us with uh, 14 more chapters. So a total of 15 videos if we continue uh, on that path. But we'll see. Maybe some videos will make them longer or... Or I don't know. There's a wolf. Might not be our wolf, but that's a wolf. Yeah, so we do come back to the village. Man. And there's still a guy over there. Interesting enough. Um, I think now we have areas that we can actually search. For example. Kill a crow. 
Hopefully there's nobody here. They've taken the body of the cop, or maybe it's just- <laughs> Oh, disintegrated! Oh my god, these things are disgusting. What's up with their face? Next. Okay. Call me whatever you want to call me, but I don't remember. Yeah, this man, this gun is much more potent, huh? That little handgun packs a punch. Oh no. Oh. They've put more bear traps. All right, so I was talking about these things here. If we take a look at the map, we've got this. Now we can access down below. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to get the TMP here. I think that's only like a thing you do in the beginning if you sacrifice your loot for for the weapon. But eventually, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to buy it anyways. In the meantime, we'll get some necessary ammo. Just in case, I wasn't sure if the rats were going to be a part of an objective. Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. You like that, Grandma? Huh? And these people are getting worse. Okay, so... See if I can sneak behind this one. Oh fuck. Let's go for the limbs, Leon. I'm going more for the limbs on this episode. Just kind of gauge. And see how that works out for us. You know? Okay, so this right here is gonna be the church. I have to go back and check these other areas out. I think I can open those doors now. Um Unfortunately there is no way back there, it seems like. Unless I go through here and take Grandma out. <laughs> what were you doing here? Damn it! It's kind of funny. I, I've literally oh, I've come into their place. You know, I'm the one who's been trespassing into this village. They were just minding their own business as you know, village folk and killing people and injecting them. And ah, it's locked. Being cruel. Okay, what what do we do here? Huh. Won't open. Mm. Okay, that's on locked now. So that's a shortcut, right? Yeah. That's exactly where we were just at. Um I'm gonna be looking at the map here and there because it is important. I feel like it's the only way we can rule everything out. So we can use this key for this drawer here and we've got a vintage compass we also have the treasure map if you guys remember we do have a treasure map um where is the treasure map didn't we buy one So, this is what I wanted to do initially. Just for fun. <laughs> oh, one hell of a trade there, Gramps. One hell of a trade. Wow, I forgot about the snakes. Give me a snake egg. Or whatever it is you give. Oh, viper. 
What can we do with the Viper? I don't remember. If we got a Viper in the original, if we got eggs, I don't. I do not recall. Oh, wow. Yo, this area looks awesome. Look at the fog on the ground. Very, very nice. Hmm. It's funny how we've been injected with the plague, right? And we're seeing images of this guy. And we don't even know who he is. Illuminados 4-9. Sleep well and flourish, dear child. As your body grows, your mother's shall soon you small clothes. At seven quintal of wheat and a half a bull a day, you have outgrown your pen. Flourish, dear child, for the sake of your brothers and sisters who cannot. Totally not fucking weird. Could that be the El Gigante Skull? It's gotta be, right? I mean... I don't see anything else being that big. If you guys don't know who El Gigante is, um, you'll find out soon enough. Don't worry. Alright, there's something else here. The treasure. This is why you use the map. And now we're clear. Good. Or not. <gasps> Welcome! How you doing, pal? I mean, I've missed you. I'm telling you, it's been rough out here. So the merchant tip, the prudent choice. Sick of uh, constantly running out of ammo? Well, have I got a treat for you. The bolt thrower or something else, mate. The bolts um, can be retrieved and, re and reused so you can keep shooting forever. Also, don't forget to buy the bolt recipe to turn your extra knives into well bolts. Never worry about ammo again. And that's not all. You can affix the bolt with attachable mines, proxim proximity explosives, to quickly turn the weapon into a powerful mine thrower. Shoot an enemy to see them explode instantly or at a surface to set them as a proximity mine. You'll lose the bolt, but it'll be worth it. Got okay. some new wares, stranger. You're in for a treat. Okay. Hold on. The Viper Hunter, a dear friend of mine, is gravely ill, and I'd very much like to treat uh, treat them with some delicious vipers before they pass. Is there a snake charmer willing to land a hand? Hmm. Request. Sell three vipers. Area none specified. Okay, so that's something we could do along the way. Perhaps. Uh, gun rhymes with fun for a reason, stranger. <laughs> Well, yeah, I love this God. guy, man. I got something new for you. Okay, so uh, discounted items. Discounts are only available that during the chapters. In your pocket or your life. They appear in. All right, so I'm running into a problem right now. I've tried it twice. The game is frozen twice whenever I go into the merchant, and it just freezes on me. So I'm kind of scared to interact with Welcome. them. Welcome. So I'm just gonna do that. Trigger that. Do yourself, stranger. For some reason, it's freezing on me. I don't know why. As you can see, I've got to break all these things again. Um, Nothing but let's see if we could just sell something. Something new for you, mate. Sell everything, right? Not bad. Hopefully, this doesn't freeze on me here. A deal well struck. <laughs> Damn. Maybe I should have freaking. I'll buy almost anything. Okay, I can well do this. Done, That's one out of the three vipers he needs. I don't know if I should keep the rubies and the emeralds just in case. Thank um, you. Simply because, remember, we can combine them with different things and then sell it for more. So I'm going to keep those for now. I don't think anything I need come it. Back anytime. Fuck it, I'm you buying it. Bang for Where I'm you buying the TMP. Your pocket? I'm going to put this into the storage. I'm kind of rushing this area because I don't want it to freeze again. Um, but realistically, I shouldn't be rushing this. I should really be looking into this as best as possible. We got the TMP. We can repair the knife. Anything um, else I can help you with? Should we get the bolt action rifle? We've got a scope for it. That cash in your pocket or your life. Easy choice, mate. 
we've got the bolt thrower, which could be handy. Um, it's limited offer as well. Your All inventory is open, full. Man, I feel like we're getting a little bit too stacked here. Let's see how that feels, mate. I'll go ahead and give like that an upgrade. Should notice the difference right away. Recipe, we've got the grenade. Got the bolts. All my wares are in tip-top shape. Hmm. I assure you. Anything else I can help you with? I can repair this. Crossing your Pocket. T's, dotting your I's. That's the way to be. That's right, baby. This ain't a charity. Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> We're gonna need all the help we can get. I'm a little bit bummed because we did have uh, a nice special on the rifle. And then the game froze, and then I didn't have that special anymore. Unless it was for the bolt thrower, and I didn't realize it at first. Church. I made it. We have made it to the church. It's crazy how similar this game is. I mentioned it last time. The similarities in this game with the original are awesome. Sorry, Gramps. You know, I know you're just minding your own business. Digging your grave. Your time is up. We've been lingering around these lands for long enough. Hold on, let me see if there's another one over here. Was that the only guy here? No, I hear I hear somebody vomiting over there. Where is he? There's a little cabin right here. Ooh, submachine gun ammo. You know that TM TMP is locked and loaded. Fuck. Break yourself, Grandpa. Wait. Oh. Uh. Not bad, right? Not bad, right, Gramps? Take the kitchen knife. And then the resources. I really need to start getting rid of the resources just to get ammo. Let's go here. Um, hold on. If we go here, craft. There we go. Shotgun ammo. I feel like that's harder to get. Craft um, some machine gun ammo. Damn, we probably should have probably also got in the fucking rifle. Oh my god, this is incredible. Finally. Damn it. Condor one to roost. The church is sealed up. And baby eagle? Negative. Nothing yet. But they sure do have this place locked up tight. I see. I can think of one reason they'd want to do so. Oh, she's here. That's for sure. I'll find a way in. Condor one, out. And there's something about this game, you know, like you're you're basically in an abandoned island of sorts. And it's so different than than just Resident Evil or the Resident Evil games prior to this. There's just a certain vibe to this game. Even on the original, this one obviously emphasizes on uh, emphasizes on that vibe a lot more. But it's just an unmatched sort of experience. It's it's beautiful. I freaking love it. All right, we've got another treasure map here. A yellow diamond. Ooh. A photo of Ashley. Keep her locked in the church until the appointed time. So she is in the church. Let me go ahead and save again. I don't mean to make this game about saving, but we gotta save. And this is the map. A pest fro, or a pest from the outside has come for the girl. Lock her in the church and... Something orders under the Lord until then keep the church door shut. The key will be held in the cave on the right side of the lake. The monster will deal with the foolish intruder. Okay, so that's like a little riddle puzzle lake. across the lake. Let's hope for no more surprises. <laughs> uh, okay, so before we do that, we have 
Let me go back here. I remember there was something here. Or maybe later on in the game. Those traitorous, uh, tra traitorous, traitorous, I don't know how to pronounce that word, twins should not be allowed to rest in peace for joining the evil cult. Won't someone, anyone, destroy the emblems engraved upon their tombstone? Request destroy the tombstone emblems. Area of the church. Oh. Okay, so that looks pretty significant. Maybe like something we can attach multiple diamonds to. Now I've got to go ahead and probably find the tombstones. Let's go back real quick. Again, I'm trying to take my time. Obviously, if the videos start tanking, then, you know, I'll, I'll kind of be a little bit more... Uh, I don't want to say rushed, but we'll get more to the point. But right now, it's, it's the first couple of episodes, and I'm just really trying to take my time. We could just shoot all of them off. Fuck it. It's gotta be these. Yeah. Okay. Little challenges, man. That's awesome. Nice little incentives. This is probably locked. Okay, good. I was hoping it'd be locked. I'm going to go upstairs here. Because I'm assuming this is going to be a dead end and probably acquire some loot. And then we can go back down. A flash grenade. Perfect. Can I really climb an entire set of ladder? Just for a flash grenade. Ridiculous. Alright, perfect. Here we go. The fuck was that? Is that me? Huh? I swear, man, I'm hearing things. Oh, hold on. Hello? There's a door. I'm gonna go ahead and unlock it from the inside. The lake. Lago. Ooh. Oh my god. Man, this is so crazy. I'm going crazy, crazy, crazy. Just thinking about you, baby. Don't they stop? I'm right here, dork. I mean, don't you see me? Come on, get down, Gramps. Alright, seriously, I should have just waited for this guy to drop. Don't you dare throw that shit. I'm gonna hold them back here real quick. And hit him with the big finale. You know what I'm saying? Mi cuerpo. How is this dude just took a bullet to the forehead? He's like 65. Uh, I just stayed dead. Must have slipped. <laughs> oh, another viper. Oh, I think I got that with the explosion. Matter of fact. Perfect. That's two out of three vipers. No! No puedo caminar. Oh. Man, it just doesn't get better than this. Fuck. Alright, let's go up top. See if we find anything. I'm not trying to use a TMP just yet. Oh, a nice little hand grenade, huh? Somebody's behind me. Shit. 
of the way. Yeah, you really have to kind of stop to shoot. <laughs> oh man, if you're bilingual or you speak Spanish, you're gonna appreciate the the dialogue. It's it's fucking great. I didn't get that later. All right, so the question here is, do I want to go? Yeah, I can go around. Perfect. I wasn't sure. Ah, oh, you see? And there's loot on the other side. No, there's not. Come on, boys. Don't, don't, don't be all sorts of crazy now. Messing around with a cop. Sorry, must have slipped. Yo, what the? F Where do these guys come from? It's kind of funny because it's like, do you want to damage your knife? Um, just to deflect an attack versus possibly take the risk and not damage it. But then you, yeah. I don't know, it's just one of those. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take this first aid. Now we do have here. I think it's down below. So we can continue going. I think this area is clear. Hmm. Another tripwire. How great is that? Still haven't used the uh, TMP. Let me see. I wanted to check something out. Examine. Okay, I thought I could put some of the stones on that thing. Never mind. Perfect. Perfecto. And we've got this here. Which kind of goes around. Alright, so this is a dead end. So it's got to be this way. For sure, it's got to be this way. There's the note. Hmm. Good luck finding someone big enough to use this thing. Oh my god, is this El Gigante already? Destroy the blue medallions. Is there anyone who can destroy those blue medallions? The area is polluted by the presence and I cannot bear it. Destroy all the medallions, quarry, fish farm. There's five of them. Sheesh. It's here. Yep. This place was so iconic. Oh, shoot. Oh, I can hear him breathe. So menacing. Creepy. Let's see how they change this, though, huh? These crows don't give a crap, dude. See, he's back there. He's just waiting. He's hiding. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm a little scared. Can't use that here. Shoot. That sucks. Resources. We're going to need all the resources we can get. Look at this. They are stacking us up right now. For good reason, too. For good reason. Got some barrels in here. I'm going to go ahead and grab that. Um, we have gunpowder. We haven't really mixed anything with gunpowder. Hmm. Perfect. I mean, our 
our TMP is looking loaded, bro. 130 plus bullets. That's freaking crazy. Here's the guy. Exactly like the original, man. This is nuts. Hexagon piece A. Let me let me save the game. We got the merchant over here moaning and stuff. I see you took care of a request. Well done. So Get cash back. Instead of letting your unused guns collect dust, why not sell them and spend the extra cash to upgrade your weapons you do use? When you sell a weapon you've tuned up, you'll get almost all the expenses you put back into it. Almost. Keyword. There's no catch, mate. We're just rooting for you. Okay, I appreciate that. Hold on. I just gotta see here. So that's a request done and dusted, eh? Good stuff, yeah. mate. What the hell? Which way do we go? There's so many options. <laughs> Good stuff, stranger. Well then, what can I do you for? Alright, I might as well... Um... Let me see, should I buy... Let me go ahead and sell some stuff first. Uh, sell this. Thank you. Sell the velvet well, blue. Well. I can certainly do something. <laughs> I knew you were a go-getter. Yeah, that's, I don't think I'm going to use this, to be honest. Thank you. Might be a bad idea, but I don't think I'm going to be using that much more. Um, tune up. We can tune this up. Your uh, weapons are in good hands. We could probably buy the, the rifle. We should buy the rifle. All my wares are in tip-top shape, I assure. I'll hand this over when you've got the space. Fuck. Cancel the purchase. Never mind. We don't have space for that. Thank goodness. Um, can we buy a bigger case? No cases available right now. What you see is what I've got. Tune up. Reload speed. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a I don't want to get I don't want to keep upgrading the shotgun because I feel like we're going to come across a new shotgun eventually. We're starting to get an idea of your tastes, friend. Hmm. There you are, as you wish. Probably sell some of these. Oh, a deal well struck. <laughs> a deal well struck, eh? Right, I think we should probably life just... needs care every once in a while. Could be the difference between life and death. Durability. Power. Come back when you can You know actually what, actually? Pay, I'm gonna sell this Thank and you. tune up the knife. Yeah. Durability. Dazzled, are you? <laughs> Our craftsmen. Pleasant travels. Okay. I can do I, I can do that. I can definitely do that. Alright, so now we've got options. First and foremost, can I go down below? Yes I can. Second of all. What's over here? Is this where the boss is? Hold on. Well, oh, that's the lake. That's the cop. That's a freaking cop. What the hell was that? Yeah. Fuck off.
See, there's multiple areas to go through now. Go down here, I guess. Let's see what the heck's going on. The boat fuel is stored with the generator fuel inside the processing building at the fish farm. Take only what you need. All right, we're dropping down. Hmm. We need two more, two more pieces. Two more hexagon pieces. Oh, we've got a yellow herb. And a kitchen knife. That's just lovely. More barrels, more loot. More shenanigans. Gosh, we are in trouble, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, dude. Fuck off. We're gonna freaking die here. Sorry, must have slipped. Oh, God, it's so nice. It's so fucking nice. Let's take this thing out before it completely starts mutating on us. We've got a green herb, and we've got really, really bad health. Um, perfect. No, no. Alright, good. Alright. A little bit of a sloppy start here. But you know what? What's important is we got through it. We did it together. <laughs> now we're back in business. We gotta kind of gather ourselves here. It's one out of five. We should be able to gather more stuff as we keep looting. All right, let's see. Let's take this way out. Let's see what we have up here. Got another barrel here. Now we can go back down, or what happens if I go here? Same thing, right? Beginning? Yeah. Reload all my guns. Make sure we are ready for war, as they say. Oh, fuck. You can't tell me that in here, bro. What? Am I going to need, like, a red dot or something? I know there's a red dot upgrade. Last and final Viper. But at this point, I'm kind of concerned. Do I really need to get the red dot for better precision? Because it's not the first time we do those shots and we just completely miss. And it's making me look bad. Okay, there's an herb there. Oh, they've got dynamites, guys. They've got dynamites on deck. Where the 
puedes correr, pero no te cuerpo. Shut up. Uh. Take a knife to the head. That's right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Perfect. I don't even know where they're coming from at this point. I hear them from every single possible angle. And it's like they just keep spawning on me. I'm trying to hit the torch. See if he can burn himself. Maybe it's best if I play it safe. Go for the limbs. Little treasure right here. Alright, that's good. <laughs> Get faded, punk! Oh, that's another viper. There's another viper there. Here we go. Yeah, this TMP works, bro. Terrible recoil. But man, it rocks. Fuck. Where's that viper? Sweet. Going down through here. I grab the loot I just shot down. Can I grab it? Ooh, an antique pipe. Wow. That's pretty nice. A black bass. Down and under, it seems. There it is. And another hexagon piece. I mean, we, we need the pieces in order to move forward. We need one more piece. So we have to be here. This is the right place. Sorry, little bird. Today's not your lucky day. We've got another small key. Let's go ahead and open this up. I think there's a viper right... Yep, right there. I know the merchant's only looking for three. But a couple more don't hurt. We've got another egg. There's so much looting, man. I freaking love this. All right, we've got the bow fuel. This is what I'm talking about. Perfect. Now we can put this on the boat and go out to the lake and, you know, face the beast. All right, nothing else here, right? There's something. If I go... Hold on. If I go this way, there's something on this side. <clears throat> I'm gonna go upstairs. I don't want to miss that that medallion. Maybe if I go over here. Hold on. I keep looking this way. If you guys see me ever look this way, it's because I'm looking at the camera, making sure it doesn't like, you know, freeze on me like it always does. I'm not checking myself out. Just making sure we don't we don't lose our shit here. Alright, so this could actually be... Hmm. This medallion could be... Hidden in plain sight. I have no idea. Yeah, it's not here. Oh my god. Fuck out of here. Wow, that did nothing to her. No me jodas. Te voy a joder, vieja. Me cago en tu madre. Well, they're all gonna come over. I guess we drop here. No. Where's that blue medallion? It's here. I'm 
this oh man there it is three out of five I know there's another one back where we came from Technically, did I just do like a collateral hit or something? We don't technically gotta finish these guys. But to be honest, three, four bullets for the loot might just be worth it. Seems like they always drop something. And look at the knife go now that we've been upgrading it. How, how, how many more times we can stab these guys, right? Here we go. <laughs> Why not trees? Wow, what's down here? Let me go down here real quick. We haven't really checked this area out. What do we have here? A brass pocket watch. Pesetas? Pesetas, anyone? Ooh. Oh, I hear something. Where is it? I can't see anything. I'm fucking blind. Here we go. This guy's hair, bro. Fabulous. Ready, Leon. It's coming. It's gonna get ya. I'm dying to see what this looks like. Here it goes. Think you can swallow me whole, huh? <laughs> Who's real bitch? Think you're gonna come here? Mess up my plans? I don't think so. I've gotta save the president's daughter. Like literally, like my life depends on it right now. Oh, come on, I hit him right in the mouth. I shoved that shit right in his throat. That's another one. And another one. I'm just gonna wait it out. I 
I thought I could actually hold it. Coming. Where'd you go? Get it, get it, get it. Oh god. God, fuck my boat. My boat. Oh shit! It's the Loch Ness monster. Tough son of a bitch. <gasps> Alright, my face cam is still going. This is incredible. And the waves are low. Can't see shit. <gasps> no! No, it cannot. Man, come on, dude. Nice, we got it. Wow, that was close. Freaking chapter. This game was what really made Leon the badass that, that we know and love. You know, Resident Evil 2 was his introductory phase, but this is like this was just so different than anything else. And being able to just relive this is phenomenal. I'm I'm loving this right now. Like I, I can play this for, for days and days, non-stop, hours on hours. Like I'm I'm just gonna keep going. This this is awesome. Thank you guys for watching. If you are enjoying the Resident Evil 4 remake series. Feel free to drop it a like if that's something you guys are into. Stay tuned. We will be back.